Hey guys, Techman Chukwuta video for you guys. In today's video, we're going to show you how to fix your iPhone 14 if the screen is black. Now, this is an issue that might have occurred on iPhone 14, 14 Plus, 14 Pro, or the 14 Pro Max, any of the iPhone 14 lineup, and also applies to other devices. Once in a while, you might see the screen is completely black, just like this, and you try to turn it on. It doesn't turn on by holding the side button. You press the button. You can't get anything out of your phone. So here's a couple things to try. The very first thing to try if you're having this issue is doing a forced restart on your iPhone. So how do you do a forced restart? Now it's important instruction here, a couple sequence of buttons that you have to follow. First thing is you're gonna press and release the volume up, followed by press and release the volume down one after another, so volume up, volume down. And finally, you're gonna hold this big side button on your right hand side until you see the Apple logo appear. You might have to hold it about five, sometimes you know, up to 10 seconds for it to turn on. So I'm gonna do volume up, volume down, Finally, I hold this side button just like that. Again, remember, volume up, volume down. Finally, once you see the Apple logo, we're in business. You can let go of that button and wait for the phone to turn on normally. Now, this method will not delete any of your personal data. All it is doing is restarting the phone in a way that reloads the code. So if it's a code or software-related bug infecting your iPhone 14, it will fix it for you and you should be in business again. Now let's say you did this and it still didn't work. Another thing you wanna do is charge your phone for at least half an hour to one hour with the right charging cable. Sometimes we find that a phone is dead and it just maybe turned off or died without us knowing some reason and we need to charge it with the correct charging. You wanna ensure that you're using one of those 20 watt Apple adapter, especially for the new iPhone 14 that works the best with a genuine Apple Lightning cable, just like that. And again, give yourself about half an hour to 45 minutes to ensure that the phone, if the battery needs a charging, let it charge. Don't panic if it doesn't turn on right away. And once you charge it, it should automatically turn on. If not, after charging for half an hour to even an hour, do the same exact thing with the force restart that we showed you with the volume up, volume down, and then holding the side button. And hopefully once you do that, you should be back in business. Now, the last thing you can do if you're still having issues, you can also try to charge it using a MagSafe charger if you're using one of those MagSafe wireless charger because who knows, maybe your charger cable or this cable, sometimes they become uh, defective and they don't work correctly. So go ahead and try a MagSafe charger for wireless charging. And again, wait till half an hour to 45 minutes if you do have that. Now, also other pro tips that I wanna mention, again, these are kind of common things that sometimes occur is there's a dust buildup on the charge port so if your phone is dead and you're not able to get that connection you try to clean it out if you don't have that wireless charger to test it out and you can usually something simple to clear it out if there's a dust buildup on the connector here it will not turn on your phone so once you follow all these tips I sure the phone will turn on and if it doesn't turn out there's most likely some kind of hardware related issue but for the most part if you do follow these steps it will fix it for you and i hope this video was helpful and your iphone 14 is now working if so please make sure to like and subscribe button thanks for watching guys see you guys next time